Hey guys, it's Laura. Welcome back to my channel. So long time no see. Um, I really don't have a good excuse for not posting recently. I just kind of haven't been feeling it. It's been struggling to come up with anything creative. I did work on some Valentine's Day happy mail, but I didn't record any of that. I don't even think I took pictures to post on my Instagram. Uh, it was a struggle, <laughs> but this is a VR for Sidegate Crafts, Tanya. She has been on YouTube for a year now, so she wanted to have a little challenge. I will have her channel linked below. All she is requesting is a tag flip. So she does ask that it is in some kind of Easter or spring theme. So Easter, flowers, butterflies, any of that. Um, and she does request on one page you have at least two rosettes one page you have some trim samples another page you have at least two bows and then an additional page is crafter's choice i did use this cartabella floral number three for this project and yeah i'm just gonna show it to you i didn't really think i was gonna film this either but um a little bit since i've made a video so this is what I came up with. So please ignore the background. It's pretty dirty right now, but I needed to adjust my camera so you guys could actually see this. So each of the main tags are three and a half by six. This was actually a sticker from that collection. I just put on some cardstock, popped it up. I just did a few clusters here, tried to pull out some of the colors from the collection. These are some little metal leaves here, here, and here. Uh, this is actually a bead, but I really liked the color. I did stitch as much as I could. This one is a sequin pocket, and so I just made this little mix. And so this is just purely decorative. I actually should have started with this first. I am just going to have this hanging from the front. It's just a little bead dangle, again, with all of the colors from the collection. So we have purples, blues, greens, pinks, and golds. Um, a couple little charms on here. And then this little butterfly hoop down here. So this is attached with a clasp, so it can actually be taken off. And again, that is that first pocket. And so this next page is just the trims that I'm going to be sending. I just have this pink one, this really pretty, like, blue mint color. This glittery one. And this is actually, like, sticky on the back. And this little daisy trim. So I have these attached on the back. They're all clipped. Here we have the bows. I just used some of the same paper that I had already used from this collection. And just a little gold center on the inside. So super simple. I was able to get this project done in a couple of days, so it will be going out soon. By the time you guys see this, she will have already received it. So I knew with making that shaker pocket, I did want to give a sequins mix. So this is the mix, just a bunch of colors from the collection. I made this little pocket. This is another sticker from the collection. I just popped it up. I did some gold thread on the background. We have a couple little dangly pieces here and then just some trim along the bottom. Here are my two rosettes. So I do not have any rosette dies, um, but I do enjoy making these crepe paper rosettes. So I made some of those. And that was it for the requirements. I have little notes to myself <laughs> and so i did want to send like a couple of little goodies this is what i came up with um the only reason this ribbon is here is on the side is because i didn't want this bag to sting open in transit and so it has ribbon on this side ribbon on the back side just to kind of reinforce those edges and then this is just a bunch of charms and beads and just all kinds of fun stuff. Basically, a lot of the leftover stuff that I had pulled to potentially use. I just thought I would give it to her. So that is what I'm going to be sending to her, as well as a couple of store-bought goodies. So definitely go check her out. I will have her channel linked below. Uh, Tanya, when you receive this, I hope you enjoy what I made for you. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.